Hi everyone, may the grace of the Lord be upon you always. I praise the Lord for His love and yours forever. I just want to share to you my testimony how I came to know God. It started when I read the one verse from the book of Matthew chapter 24 verse 7. It says, um, Nation will rise against nation and kingdom against kingdom. There will be famines and earthquakes in various places. All these are the beginning of birth pains. Wow, when I read this verse, I just say, uh, it, it's like it's happening now. This verse is like uh, telling us uh, the same as happening now. So I check this uh, verse and I continue to read the book of Matthew and to my surprise, I'm, I'm amazed what everything is said in this book. It's really fascinating. So I continue to, to read the Word of God as I go to the book of John. And the book of John is so powerful as well. It's like God speak to me. Whatever I ask, God answer me. And it's so powerful because it's it's Jesus who's talking here so as I read the I finish the, the, the poor gospel I start uh, joining the Bible study fellowship and as I and I say um, doing the fellowship uh, I grow more and know God more and then that that's the time I start to share to my husband at first my husband don't want to go but until something happened he dreamed of Jesus in three ways first it when he encountered Jesus in his dream he saw Jesus in his dream second he saw hell and even his you know he is finished the dream he can still smell the sulfur. Third, he dreamt about the rapture. I don't know if you're familiar with rapture. It said in the Bible, one is when this will time will come. Uh, one will come. One will will t- be taken. It will disappear, and one will be left behind. So this is what I'm talking about in the Bible 24 as well. So after then. Um, I share my testimony to anyone who I, you know, I seen or my loved ones, whatever. After that, uh, God shows me a lot, a revelation and experience in supernatural ways. But I cannot say it here because it will take us long. So I just encourage you, brothers and sisters, that this is the time and our opportunity to know God, to get right with God. Because it's locked down, we don't do anything. Just, I encourage you to read the Word of God. To, um, before you, you know, before everything else, put God first in your daily, daily lives. Because it's very important. Just as the Bible says, uh, our life is like a vapor. It just goes away, disappears quickly. So I, I just want to give you a one verse. Um, it's in Revelation 3, chapter 3, verse 19. To whom I love, I rebuke and discipline. So be earnest and repent. Here I am, I stand at the door and knock. If anyone hears my voice and open the door, I will come in and eat with him and he with me. To him who overcomes, I will give the right to sit with me on my throne, just I overcome and sat down with my father on his throne. He was here, let him hear what the Spirit says to the church. Amen. Praise the Lord. So I encourage you, brothers and sisters, to heed the word of God, listen to his voice, and may the Lord bless you and give you... um, discernment in everything you do. God bless. Amen.